Only on KHOU 11 tonight, we're talking to a Houston ISD teacher who is still employed after the district tried to fire her. She is now being paid to stay at home. Maria Aguilera met with the teacher who's not sure what's next. Maria. Len Mia, the attorney representing that teacher, reached out to HISD today asking for her status within the district. This comes after almost no communication since a hearing in June when it was determined that she should be placed back in the classroom, yet she is still at home. It's just one day at a time. Michelle Williams is not backing down. She's a longtime educator for HISD and more recently also the president of the teachers union Houston Education Association. I'm still on administrative leave in limbo, she says, since the district took her out of her third grade class in March and began the process of termination during a quote inappropriate conduct investigation. We reported back in March, Williams was accused of using social media in her class during school hours. Yet, she said she used an at-home studio and scheduled posts ahead of time. Her attorney tells us that evidence was presented during a virtual hearing in June. The independent hearing examiner found that the district did not meet its burden to non-renew her contract um, and recommended that she be placed back. Uh, Gianna Ortiz tells us the hearing examiner said the district used incomplete, contradictory and retaliatory information. That's all I wanted to do is be vindicated because I knew that it was retaliation and she did that for me. Williams has openly criticized Superintendent Mike Miles' policies and after winning her hearing, took another step against HISD this month. I filed a formal complaint asking TEA to investigate the, the West Division leadership. In the Code of Ethics violation letter sent to TEA, Williams said false statements were made against her and the allegations were not investigated thoroughly. She continues to be employed by the district and yet they do not uh, put her talents to work. Williams says she's not going to stop fighting for herself and other teachers. I just wanted to clear my name because they were making some accusations against me, which were totally false, which was proven, especially by the um, hearing officers. I reached out to HISD today for common, but have not heard back yet. Meanwhile, Williams is waiting for directives from the district. She tells me she started as a teacher here at HISD and she doesn't plan or want to work anywhere else. Live outside HISD headquarters, Maria Aguilera, KHOU 11 News. As it says, the story goes on. Maria Aguilera, thank you.